to have only low calorie food for both of them. It also has to be limited for both of them. Um, and if you're around and you're concerned about the, the thinner one being too thin, then you have to add more while you're around. But the other one, you have to get it moving. You have to play with it. You have to get it exercising. So reduce the, uh, the, the low calorie, calorie and the fat. Limit it and work get them. them moving. That's exactly it. All right. That's the and only answer. Check with your vet. Whew. Well, I'm glad Laura made it on the show, and she really did a great job. And Judy Al, thank you so much. Thank you, We'll take a break here on Animal House Calls when we come back. Uh, the I Am's Friends for Life Pet Adoption Drive. Stay with us. <laughs> Bye, Laura. Imagine your life if you won. Lotto 649. The next jackpot is $26 million. Flora by Gucci, the new fragrance. You're on the move, and you're already up to a 1,000 yards in just half an hour. That's why you need a diaper that flexes in all the right places. Cruisers with Comfort Flex. It flexes to fit in high motion areas, especially around the legs and waist. It's our best fit ever to help stop leaks, no matter how much you move. Cruisers with Comfort Flex. From Pampers. Are you sitting on a gold mine? How would you spend some extra money? We're going on a cruise. I love my new TV. Woohoo! Harold the jewelry buyer will turn your unused jewelry into instant cash. Jewelry is not forever. Free up some cash for something special. It was so easy. Now I'm ready to shop. Cash in now for courteous professional service. It's the jewelry buyer. Bathurst Street, three lights south of Lawrence. I got ADT because my neighbors were robbed. But ADT did a lot more than protect me from burglaries. I was at a meeting when the fire started. Molly was all alone. Fortunately, ADT was looking out for us. They acted fast and called the fire department. They rescued Molly just in time. ADT saved my home and the most important things in it. Every day, ADT is there for our customers with an easy way to arm and disarm your system fast alarm response, and our advanced network of monitoring centers. A single ADT system can help protect your home from burglary, fire, and carbon monoxide. When an alarm is received, ADT can respond quickly, calling the local authorities for help. And you get this monitored protection, plus great local service, starting at about a dollar a day. You could even save up to 20% off your homeowner's insurance. What good is an ordinary smoke detector if there's no one around to hear it? I know ADT will hear it. Call now and save $250 when you buy ADT's family package. ADT. Always there. Want your long way to give you more? Well, get on out of that department store and into CoverGirl Outlast. No department store long way gives you so many different ways to last through breakfast, lunch, and dinner. More choices, more shades, more Outlast. Breaking news from the city's East End reports of a school in lockdown. Let's go live right now to the scene. We will bring you the very latest on this developing story only on Toronto's breaking news, CP24. Welcome back to Animal House Calls, the Etobicoke Humane Society. They join us at a representative and a beautiful cat. So Jennifer Grotto is the human and the kitty cat is whom? Who are this we speaking is champagne. to? champagne. Champagne is a big, beautiful feline. He is. He's huge. He's a little scared right now, so he wants to stay on my lap, but he's gorgeous and very gentle. Why did you name him Champagne? Actually, the man who uh, surrendered him named him Champagne. Champagne was a stray, and he happened to pick a great home to try and bake for food at, and this man took him in, 
and basically brought him to us. And I can see what yeah. might be the results of frostbite on Champagne's ears. Actually, that's the result of okay, fighting. Fight? Oh. Yeah. And Champagne has FIV, which is why he's on the show today. Okay. Um, he's been in the shelter for seven months, which is a really long time for a cat. We should explain what FIV is and what the ramifications of it are. Absolutely. FIV is feline immunodeficiency virus. And it's basically the feline form of HIV, which humans get. It's only contagious to cats. Now, I'm going home to be with my cats after this right. show. What do I need to do in order to prevent the spread of this? Or, or does it spread from human contact to animals? No, it spreads through bodily fluids, so most okay. commonly through biting and their saliva. Okay. So really, you could wash your hands, but it doesn't make a big All difference. Right. So my cats aren't at risk or any other animals that might be here. Is it passed right. on to... Uh, dogs no, as well, it's not. strictly within the feline just feline. group. And it, does yeah. it affect his health at all? Well, it will. He'll be more susceptible. His immune system is suppressed. Mm -hmm. So uh, if he sneezes or gets sick, um, you, he would need attention right away. Okay. As, and they probably should anyway. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah, but he can live a long life. Can he live a long life if he had a companion who also was uh, FIV? Yes, that's yeah. important for Champagne. He needs to go to a home that's uh, he's either the only cat right. or one where there's other FIV and or cats. Yeah. Very interesting. Does yeah. it shorten his life? Not or is significantly. Or the fact that his immune system is suppressed that that might be an issue? That's the issue. Uh, it's a lot like human HIV. So he could live a full life if he's properly cared for, has a good diet, stress-free. Interesting. And yeah. and he is a beautiful cat. He's doing very well. He's handling this pressure very, very well. <laughs> Where would you so. like to see him go? Obviously, as you mentioned, uh, yeah. a, 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 the only cat in a home or with a cat, another cat that is FIV. But what else do you see for him? Well, what we would like for Champagne is for him to be in a stress-free environment. So he might not be great for small children, but he is extremely gentle. I mean, he looks kind of like he's dopey right now, but this is personality. He's a lab cat. He just loves to be petted. He's a beautiful beautiful cat yeah. and right now he's uh, languishing in someone's <laughs> home. The Etobicoke Humane Society doesn't have a shelter per se. Actually, you, oh, we do. Oh, you do. I'm sorry. Just I for cats. Didn't. Oh, just for cats. Just for cats. My misunderstanding. Well, now, what about dogs who come in through the Etobicoke Humane Society? What do you do with them? That's a foster by foster basis. I see. So yeah. that's the generosity and caring yeah. of volunteers who Absolutely. open up their homes. So the shelter for cats, tell me about that. Well, we are uh, in Etobicoke at Royal York and Eglinton and we have roughly 30 odd cats that come to us for a variety of reasons um, and we do our best to care for them we're 100% donation and volunteer run so is he uh, sequestered somewhere segregated somewhere maybe those aren't the right words but he's somewhere else so that it, it, because he's FIV actually he has his own cage and the animals are only let out one by one so he okay. has no direct contact with any other animals you also encourage vets to open up their clinics I know dr. John Allen from the Royal York Veterinary Hospital has a, a, a some uh, adoptables from the Etobicoke Humane Society, which is very nice when vets Absolutely, do that. Absolutely, yeah. Yeah, great. All right, quickly, the IAMS program. What is this about? How does it affect you? Well, the IAMS Friends for Life is a, is a good chance for us to uh, uh, partner ourselves with a retail product uh, and educate the public on adoption and the kinds of things that people don't necessarily know that you really need to Ooh, look at the cat there. Do your homework <laughs> when you're selecting an animal. It's it's not a quick process. It should yeah. be something that you give significant thought to. Because you're hopefully together for a very long time. Absolutely. Cats live for what, 20, sometimes 20, 25, sometimes 25. If you're lucky, if you're lucky. Yeah. And you have a walkathon coming up in June. We do on June 20th in West Dean Park, and uh, you can check out our website for that. Great. And that's a big aspect of your fundraising. Absolutely. It's huge for us. Yeah, yeah very, very important. Well, I hope to see you before. For that again, Thank you. it was wonderful. And Champagne, you did a fantastic job shedding slightly because he's a little stressed. <laughs> he's a bit stressed. We all lose hair when we're stressed. Yes. <laughs> Thank you very much. Nice Thank to have you. you here. Coming up next, we're going to find out about Wolfstock, uh, the Street Fest, and the Canine Rescue Me Walk. That's next on Animal House Calls. It all comes down to this. If Derek cuts the tumor out, I can lose my memory, and if he doesn't, I can die. One decision. I am your husband, and I say that you are having the surgery. You are not having the surgery. This tumor will kill her. One moment. You don't get to quit. Nod your head for me if you know who Alex Karev is. Is it the end for one of the doctors? The most anticipated season finale of Grey's Anatomy, Thursday at 9, 8 central on CTV. Good stuff. He buys gold. Trick or treat, trick or treat. Hey.
Hello! You want treats? I've got treats. Lots and lots of treats. You like cash? I've got cash. Lots and lots of cash. Tell your mother I'll give her cash for her jewelry, watches, and diamonds.